So our name is Nathan Walters, and we're an aspiring young content creator, and we would do anything to find fame, which leads us to step foot inside an old abandoned facility that is rumored it can take everything from you, even your own mind. Welcome to Habilis, and let's see what this is all about. The name is Mad Max, and I hope you enjoy the show. Based on a true story. This recording was recovered recently, but content creator Nathan Walter's body was never found. He is still missing to this day. What's up, guys? Nathan here with Overhang Urban Exploration. Uh, I just want to say a quick thank you as we just hit 1k subscribers. That is insane. Thank you so much. Can't believe we've done this. It's an amazing milestone. Thank you all. As always, guys, I can't tell you where I am legally, but I just got a tip from a friend that mail has been building up here. Uh, yeah, <laughs> that usually means it's abandoned. So we're gonna go ahead to the front door and see if anyone is home. Okay. <laughs> that took me for a second. I thought I was about to watch something. Check the door. And we also, guys, have a battery, which really kind of sucks kind of trippy though check the front door Nathan you freaking idiot why in the world would you do this to yourself Welcome just for to likes Sarah just for fans just for subscribers save batteries press J Okay. Hello? Huh. Anyone there? So, yeah, it looks like it might be deserted. That's, well, that's good news for us. Uh, let's check the computer and see if there isn't an easy way to open this door. Deserted with full power. Access denied to find another way. Okay, I'm just gonna follow this power cord from the computer. That should lead me to its source, hopefully. What did it say? It says we can reload our battery. We're not quite there yet, though. Some security uh, setup. Aha! Oh. Breaker box. Yes. Too easy. Come on. Let's do this. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, it. Um. Yeah, it's locked. <laughs> But these things aren't really that secure. Um, I just need my Robinson number two. You guys know it's my favorite. And shit. Oh, uh, note to self, edit that out. <laughs> edit that curse out. And nope, I forgot my screwdriver. Guys, I'm sorry, that's a rookie mistake. <laughs> did, did, did never leave home without your screwdriver. Uh, however, uh, I do know these maintenance guys usually do the same thing, so they'll stash, you know, one nearby in case. Uh, let's see if I can find something to get this open. <laughs> I'm not gonna have to talk through this entire thing. He's gonna do it all for me. Oh god, what Shit. is that? What the fuck was that? Cut that out. Uh, note to Wait. self, cut that out. Oh yes, the gods are smiling on us today, guys. We are in luck. This should open the uh, breaker box. Take the screwdriver. We're just gonna jam it in this thing, you know. Nothing bad happens when you do that. Voila! Uh, guys, this is um, technically a felony. Don't, uh, don't do what I'm doing. Okay. Scott talks too much. Flip the breakers. No sirens, get in there, yes! Okay, that's good. Okay, anyway, sorry. <laughs> Let's go check the front computer again. Uh, usually a power outage should trigger the emergency door mechanism. There we go. Well, I'm already not liking the fact that I gotta find batteries. I don't know if I like this guy's voice. Now, uh, this should do it. We are in, guys. We're officially in. Also, we're not in a police car. So, you know, that's already a lot better than last time. Uh, right, let's head in. Nathan Walker. Welcome to the CRM, the world's largest manufacturer of wireless technology. 
Nathan Walters, you freaking idiot. Yep, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. Oh my god, I'm stuck in here. Tickle in my throat. <clears throat> what is that? This place is definitely abandoned. That's really good. Uh. <sighs> Damn it, I'm this change. Awesome! I think I can take this vent off with a screwdriver. Oh my god. Ow. Oh my god! That's oh, crazy! Shit. I probably uh, shouldn't show you that. I, I don't know if you can see that in the footage, logo. but oh, we just got a minor earthquake. Wild! I think we just got like a mix of something going on there. Okay. So I guess that means... Damn it again with this! Um... This is incredible. I, I've never seen anything like this. Uh... I bet this goes viral. Uh... Now what? Uh... We can really kind of mess that up. I feel bad for it. I kind of feel bad about that. Ah! Oh my god, what is that? Ooh. Oh, my eyes are playing tricks on me down here, guys. Guys, hear that? What is that? What? Oh, it sort of sounds like whispering. <laughs> Not going crazy, I guys. I swear, I, I'm I'm serious right now. Yeah, me too, man. We should have come in here. These uh, body cam type games are pretty flippin' trippy. Tammy 1992 said on my last video, you can't actually crawl in vents. So, uh, fun fact, guys. A lot of people say a vent can't support a human body. And usually, they're right. Uh, however, these large industrial facilities sometimes have more robust infrastructure to prevent a, um, collapse. This guy's so knowledgeable. I want to be like him when I grow up. <laughs> Can we turn that off for now. Ow. <coughs> yeah, shit. What, what is that? Yeah. <coughs> There's definitely some dust or something. Not my favorite. <coughs> okay. One of those freaking Star Wars things. Oh, passcode. I gotta wow. find that somewhere. There's like, there's like really no one here. Guys, so I can't tell you the name of this place, uh, but I will tell you that this used to be, well, it still is the biggest creator and distributor of technology in the world. Uh, you know, the wireless plug. Mm, I'm really more of a T person. Oh, so, okay. All right, well, that's one thing, man. Guys, y'all might want to fix that. You can cut off your freaking dialogue. It's kind of hard to get like super immersive into this though, with the guy constantly talking. Not that y'all wanted to just hear me ramble the entire time. There's a few options here. What should I do? Done here. Personal files. Let's do email. Security alert. We need backup on floor two. I can't explain this. Send backup. Send everyone. Uh, what the fuck is that? I don't like that. A lot of us are getting sick. I hear the same thing is happening at Mother Up. Can we get some information, please? This is ridiculous. Oh, shit. Um, personal files. Uh, wow, I did not need to see that. Uh, how does it even fit? Oh, here's a password. Coffee lover. Original? Coffee lover. Okay. I'm gonna forget that. Oh, yeah, this is good. It looks like a code I can use on the door panel. Alright, well, I do want to listen to a voicemail. 
I left the package on oh. your desk. From Veronica and Mother Hub. She said it's very important. I like Jesse. Oh my god! Oh. That's not oh, but again, guys. Oh. This is a little sketchy. What's sketchy is this crappy flashlight we have. If I don't need it, guys, I'm not going to use it, so I'm really, really sorry if it's super dark. Alright, coffee lover. Enter code. <laughs> What's behind door number three? Another door. Hooray! Uh... Absolutely pitch dark in here. <sighs> Flashlight, please don't fail me. Yeah, it's uh, you should have brought more batteries. <laughs> oh, oh my god. Yeah, it's too late, dog. Let's go. That ain't happening. Oh. Oh my god. What is this? <gasps> First aid. What'd that say? I... <coughs> Death box. Oh, Jesus. Uh, <clears throat> I can't go back. Oh! <gasps> this is freaking horrible. Mom, Mom, if you see this, I love you. I'm, I'm so sorry I've, I've been a dick lately. <laughs> I love you. Never tell you enough. Dude, we just started this, man. You already assume we're gonna die. We're gonna make it. Oh my god. Oh no. Oh god bless it. Oh I don't like it. Alright, we can talk to mom now. I can talk to mom now. <laughs> Holy crap! Please wish list on Steam if you enjoyed it. Thank you for playing. <laughs> that was a, uh, that was quite the intro. Well, ladies and gentlemen, there it was. Short and sweet. The Billis. My only hope is that games like this actually come to fruition. I've just seen too many times where demos pop out, things are in early access, and it either never comes out or it takes years. So hopefully that's not the case here. I do tend to enjoy these body cam games. They put you in a really trippy mindset. Nevertheless, guys, gals, it's almost October Fright Fest, and this is just a precursor of what's to come. If you like this kind of stuff, please remember to smash that like button and leave a small comment. It really helps out the channel, but most importantly, tell me what you want me to play. It's time to hear a grown man scream like his 13 year old daughter. Anyways, this is where I leave you. Guys, gals, stay frosty, stay mad, and I'll see you all in the next one.